Hi everybody, this is Felicia. Happy National Scrapbooking Day. This is going to be a fun-filled day for everybody. I'm sure a lot of games, participation. Um, I'm involved in doing a hop, so I hope you're able to get around to everybody's channels and see what everybody is doing because it's going to be a fun-filled day today. So what I'm working on here is a layout of my a grandson and I'm using the Shamil Lane uh, paper here in the background, but I also trimmed some of it off and matted it on some white cardstock. I pulled some scraps from out of my scrap bin and I'm going to be using part of those scraps as part of the background and then I'm going to be putting on all these pieces from the uh, Scraptastic Kits Drops of Jupiter. And so Right now, I just dumped out all of the, <laughs> the stuff that I'm going to be using on this layout. Um, the title is not going to contain any thickers like I normally do. So I'm going to be using that little acetate that I put up in the upper right hand corner to, uh, or as my title, it's called Capture the Moment. And so I'm, I'm starting to pretty much put all the pieces down. Now, the pieces are not going to stay where you see them right now. Because what I do is I take them all off and I rearrange them differently. Some of them are going to be in the same spot, and but most of them are not. <laughs> and you're going to see that here in a little bit. I'm using some of these, I think it was Heidi Swap stickers here. They're like a clear sticker. And you put once you put them down, you can still see the outline of the word. But you, I mean the plastic part of the outline, but you... It looks good though still once you get them down and so what I'm doing like I said is I'm putting all this I don't know why I did that I wasted all this time <laughs> arranging all these elements on a page and then I didn't even use it that way so it's just weird and I tend to do that sometimes and sometimes I'll take a picture if I really really remember to take a photo and I want it to stay that way and then sometimes like right now I forget to take a photo so but it does end up coming out okay um, once I get everything put back down take it off and then put back down so onto the photo this photo is the first black and white I've done in a while um, and this is a photo of my grandson climbing through one of the tubes on the playground and I was at the other end of the tube with my camera of course and he realized I was at the other end of the tube. Once he realized, he decided he wanted to pose for me. Now, we thought everything was all hunky-dory, right? I mean, I know this picture looks like it, but he actually did not want to climb through that tube. <laughs> so what I had to do was I had to tell him that I will meet him on the other side of the tube. And so, he was reluctant and then so <laughs> he decided that okay I'm gonna trust Nana and I'm going to do it so what he ended up doing was he kind of peeked through the tube which I thought was oh it was hilarious and I almost caught that picture but he moved too quick and then um, he decided okay I'm gonna go in so he put his feet in first and he kind of sat there for a second and then I said, come on, come on, you can do it. You can do it. Just come through the tube. I'm right here at the other end. So then that's when he decided to go ahead and go through the tube. I guess to him, it was a weird kind of a deal thing. I don't know. I don't, I really don't know what the explanation is and why he didn't want to go through the tube, but he finally did go through the tube and I was able to capture that photo and then once he went through once it was all over he kept going through again and again and again and again so i guess with some kids and in this photo right here he's about um three years old so but i guess with some kids he they uh some things are pretty scary i mean i remember when i was a kid and, uh, and they had this huge tractor tube that you can just climb through and that thing was so big. And I guess to a child that is super big, I did not want to go through it. I was, <laughs> it took me months. And by that time, it was the end of summer. <laughs> and I finally went through it. And then I was thinking to myself, what was I scared of, you know? But I don't know. Just that's the way some kids are. So 
Anyway, so now I'm finishing up here in the layout, and as you can see, I have rearranged everything, put everything in different spots, different areas. Um, I've added some new things onto this layout here. And what you're going to see me add is the word soar, but that's not until after the close-ups because I forgot to put it on during this whole entire um, layout process. And so I put it on and I figured it out and I put it on at the end and I also outlined. And that's one thing I don't do on my layouts is I don't outline. And um, sometimes that's just one of the things. Sorry about that. That was my phone. Um, okay, so I'm back. I had to take that phone call. <laughs> anyway, that's one of the things that I don't do is I don't outline. And so I'm going to start trying to do some of my layouts with some outlining. Um, not all of them, but I will try to do that. So we're finishing up the layout here and everything is just about done. And I just want to say hi and thank you for all of my new subbies. Hi guys, how are you? Um, I hope that you enjoy the videos and some of the process videos that I put up. So um, I'm excited actually because I teamed up with Megan and Hannah um, to do um, homemade kits and things like that with them. So, But I want to say welcome all you new subbies and thank you for subscribing. And if you haven't already, make sure you check out everybody else's channel today for the National Scrapbooking Day. Everybody's going to have all kinds of things. There's going to be prizes everywhere. Everything's going to be going. It's going to be pretty busy. So we'll be online almost all day. <laughs> so I want to thank you guys for watching once again. And I think I'm finishing up the journaling here. And yes, I am. The journaling just explains a little bit about his fear about going through the tube there. So and that's it guys alrighty so I want to thank you guys for watching and take care and have a great and fun and hope you win some prizes National Scrapbooking Day take care guys bye bye